I don't think a lot, but it might have an impact on who we choose. Absolutely. So, and again, it, it, we have to factor in now the citizenship issue. Right. Because in a hurry, we could fill up our allotted slots. With the first pick of the 2016 MLS Super Draft, the Chicago Fire search for talent to build their roster with a fresh perspective in GM Nelson Rodriguez and head coach Velko Ponovic. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I mean, I think he could be there in the second round. I think he could be there. Fort Lauderdale, Florida, the home of the 2016 Adidas MLS Player Combine an event where 71 of the best college soccer prospects in North America gather for a shot at realizing their dream of becoming a professional soccer player. It has to be extremely emotional. They're so close to fulfilling a life's dream. What we want is intelligent people, intelligent players who can adapt to the demandings of, of the game because uh, MLS is very competitive. To be successful in our environment, we are looking for uncommon people. Uh, we need people who are incredibly passionate about the sport and, and want to have a soccer lifestyle. Due to the rapid appointments of both Rodriguez and Ponovic, the Chicago Fire were pressed for time, which made the evaluation process at this combine even more imperative. Although he's poured over lots of videotape, there's something about seeing the player in front of your own eyes, seeing how they are off the ball, which might not be captured on video. Very good movement. Who's that? Castillo. Castillo, okay. Even the way he runs his gait. He played that for you. He did, he did. He played that for me. And I liked it. It's very exciting, and at the same time, it's very demanding, too, because you have to be prepared and there are so much information, so much things happening and you have to be aware of, of the details. I feel like I've met my soccer soulmate in Pano. We are so like-minded and so aligned with our values and, and the way to do things. It absolves pressure. After five days of evaluation, the fire are feeling confident in their process and hold no reservations towards the impending draft. This is about showing improvement uh, in the numbers, points, wins, record at home, record away, all those types of things. But it's also about identifying and finding a few more pieces to what we will consider a championship program core. We are not afraid. We are going through a process. We have our criteria. We want to take the best possible situation after the draft. We're not afraid at all. We know that come Thursday, we're gonna be a better team. So actually, it's, it's not pressure, it's a blessing. 